Hey everyone, I'm pretty excited to finally introduce my latest course on creating a 2D RTS using Godot. If you're looking to explore the basics of this genre and create your own, own RTS, uh, then this might be for you. So we'll cover everything from basic mechanics to advanced AI system, etc. So let's take a look at some of the key features that you'll learn to implement. First, we'll start off with building creation and placement. We'll learn how to create building scenes with bodies, sprites, and collision shapes. We'll implement a drag and drop system for placing buildings on the map complete with visual indicators to show where your buildings will be placed. Next, we'll add a construction mechanic. Buildings will take time to construct, so you'll see a progress bar above the building during this time. This adds a layer of strategy and realism to your game. Unit production is another essential aspect of RTSs, so you'll learn to create units from buildings implementing a production queue system and display that queue on the HUD. So managing your army has never been easier. We'll create an in-depth management resource system to handle multiple resources like wood, stone, and gold. You'll implement a storage building and show collected resources in the HUD. Then we'll go into advanced AI features, implementing patrol paths, allowing enemy units to set paths using waypoints. Additionally, we'll expand the enemy AI to include attack states, basic attack behaviors, and retreat states. Finally, you'll implement a system for resource spending on unit production and building construction. We'll add resource costs to units and buildings, which will have easy access through a global script. By the end of this course, you'll have a functional RTS game with advanced features. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced developer, this course has something for everyone. So enroll now and start building your own RTS game in Godot. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay updated with all my latest tutorials and courses. So I'll see you in the future and hopefully in the course.